Alice, how are you? I think today is um, four days short of, or like two days short of four months. So it, we're almost at four month mark. And um, as you can see by my scale shots, I'm kind of happy camper. Um, this is actually the lowest that I've gotten. I've been this weight a couple times, um, but most of the time I'm like 113 point something. So four, two, eight, um, but it seems to be where my body's settling. So um, I'm really happy with that. I don't want to lose more weight, but I certainly don't want to be above my LIW, which was the 115 marker. So um, I'm really happy about that. I realize it's the holidays, so I'm going to try to be really fast because um, you don't have a lot of time to watch anything. Um, but people ask me all the time what I eat, and I just eat everything but sugar and white flour. I just, it's not because I can't eat it. Like if I want to eat a bagel, I guess I could, but I just have no desire or want to eat it. Um, I've chosen to use HCG as a tool to get me to a place where um, my weight is uh, where I want it. And then I've also wanted to have this be a lifestyle change for me on how I eat and what I eat. So I think I'm probably um, a label reading, uh, I'm, I, I'm just a nut, I'm, I'm crazy about that. I read every single label um, because I just can't believe, frankly, that in America we put so much crap in our food and, um, and then I wonder why I was so sick with my intestines. I mean, it's just been, I mean, I have been pain, I don't want to say pain free, but I mean, I used to be at like a pain level of 10 and I'm down to maybe a 1.5 or a 2. So yeah, I think eating clean um, is just really good and you should um, read your labels. Anyway, uh, people ask me what I eat. I eat a lot of vegetables. I do not eat a lot of vegetables, that's a lie. I eat a lot of protein. Um, I don't eat a lot of vegetables. I should eat more vegetables. But um, I eat salad. So is that a vegetable? If that's a vegetable, then I eat vegetables. Um, in the morning, I love my coffee, which you guys kind of already know that about me. And then I have found, and this has been like my biggest craze lately, is um, Trader Joe muffins. I keep looking over here because I'm going to show you one. Because they're like crazy, awesome, big, and delicious. But anyway, there they are. And I don't know, can you see the, the um, nutrition facts? Okay, regardless, half a muffin, if you were to count calories, which I don't, but if you were, a half a muffin is 120 calories. But I'm sorry, I am not eating a half a muffin because it's delicious. This, yeah, look at this side, look at here, here's a hand, look at, I mean, look how big that, that muffin is. Okay, I can't do this, like that is humongous. So uh, yeah, I, I love these and they're so moist. They're so good. Um, cookies. Um, I like to, I've been trying to bake a lot on my own and just using the recipes from, oh, I should have bought those books up, but um, just go to Maria's uh, blog site or um, Ber Berenice on, on Facebook. I mean, she's got like so many recipes, but um, when I don't have time to bake, which is like most of the time, I like to still have my sweets. Um, so I have found these cookies. These are probably my favorite. Wheat free and gluten free. Um, the problem is they're expensive and there's like none in a box. <laughs> they're, uh, there's like none in a box. And you have to watch the calories. I mean, seriously, I think it's like yeah, one cookie is 110 calories. So, but anyway, can you see I like I like these? But anyway, that's what I have one left. Yeah, but they're really they're really good. But if you're one of those people that are afraid of agave, which I understand, um, I just I'm one of those people that um, I don't plan on drinking or eating gallons of agave. So the little that I have um, in my sweetened things, I don't mind. Um, but anyway, this. Um, do you, if you like Fig Newtons, this is, um, well, you can't read the label very well because I kind of ripped it open, but it's called Barbara's. 
Can you see that? Well, this is where it says Barbara's. But anyway, they're multi-grain, and two of these bars are 110 calories. And they are sweetened not with agave, but just, just fruit juice. But, yeah. Really moist, really good. Gotta love it. Um, I have one other um, cookie that I absolutely love, but we don't have any left, so I can't even show you the container. But if I can, I'll try to like edit right here and put in um, a picture, because I did upload a picture of the brand that I like. Um, because they make um, sugar-free um, like pumpkin pies and, and cookies, and they even have a website that you can order them if you don't have a Henry's by you. So um, I'll try to put that link below. If I don't put in the picture, I'll see what I can do. Um, okay, um, you're probably going to see me in the same exact outfit because I need to make a video for Merry Christmas for um, Mama Clock because I really want to be in it. Um, but I just wanted to show you what I'm wearing right now. Ah! Oh well. Hold on a second. Let me see if I can find it. I have no idea what I was just saying. But I just wanted to show you um, when I have like cravings for carbs really bad, um, these are like my favorite. Um, yeah, Annie's. I just love this brand and she makes like a, I'm assuming it's a she, um, makes like a cheddar cheese, like a white cheddar cheese cracker. And they're so cute, they're little bunnies. So like if you have kids and I mean, I have grown up kids and they, they love them too. But look at how cute. All right. All right, anyway, I love those. Oh, my biggest tip to you to keep your weight off is drink water, like a lot of it. Don't stop because you're not an HCG. Okay, so this is what I was looking for before I stopped. But just so you can see, these are the pants that I'm wearing. They're the skinny jean version, but I shop at Express. They're having a big sale right now because it's Christmas. And you like buy one pair, get 50% off. Plus, if you go online, you could get a 15% off coupon. Plus, they have all these other sales. And no, I don't work for them or make any money from them. But anyway, um, these are the ones that they are. And I'll just show you. And um, what was I going to tell you about them? Oh, well, they're kind of big in the waist. But if I go to a zero, which I can fit in, I don't feel comfortable in it because it's like squeezes my knees. So I guess I have fat knees. But um, I also don't like to feel like um, that the pants are making like a muffin. Since I don't have a muffin top, I really don't feel the need to be in a zero so that I can say I'm in a zero. Um, but technically, I can wear one. I can wear zeros. But... I don't know. Maybe it's psychological that I just keep twos. But anyway, I'll show you. All right. So I'm, it's freezing here. So, um, yeah. I have no idea what you can see. Can you see? These are cute. They're, see, like, the little the design? They're just fun. But anyway, I, I don't wear any slimmers or it's just a guinea tee. I, mean, I don't know what you can see. But anyway, but see how you can just, you know, like I have like a ton of room. Like I guess technically if this weren't YouTube, I could just pull them off. But I'm not going to. But anyway, um, oh, and my uh, sweater is, the one I'm wearing is American Eagle. Size two. I mean, uh, small, just small. Anyway, that's it. I think I've gone on long enough. So I um, hope you're doing well. And um, for those of you that were messaging me um, and telling me how you were doing, you kind of stopped. So um, tell me how you're doing. And oh, and Jibby, no, I never went back to beer. And um, I think you said pizza and beer. Don't go back to that. Um, I never was. I never drank beer. Um, I don't like beer. I have had chocolate wine, which is absolutely delicious. 
But anyway, so don't worry about me gaining weight back for that reason. Um, but I don't plan on gaining weight back. Um, if you're looking for me on Facebook or my fitness pal, chances are I'm not going to friend you. And it is nothing against you. It's just that I really have gotten to know the group of people that I have just been from the beginning of my journey and you really should find people that are where you're at in your journey so that you have stuff to relate to because it's kind of frustrating even for frankly my friends um because they'll be like you know gosh bobby you know you're below liw or whatever and they're still like in a round or something so you just kind of want to stick with people that are kind of where you're at so that's my suggestion for that so don't try to ask me what my um Facebook or my fitness pal thing is and if I don't accept you just don't please don't take it personally I just send me an email send me a message through YouTube um, if you have a question please don't ask me where to buy HCG because I don't do HCG anymore and frankly um, the kind that I did use um, they're not selling it anymore so don't ask me um, where else water drink water 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 um, okay love you guys talk to you later bye